Hey guys, what's up? My name's Katie and today's video is going to be my September favourites video. Now, I think I've missed out on like three months of doing favourites videos, but um, they're back and I am so excited to show you what I loved in the month of September and I have started to use regularly in my life. So without further ado, let's get on to the video. First things first, we will start with, I guess, the beauty and makeup related sort of things. Um, the first thing I have to show you that I loved in the month of September is the Maybelline Matte and Poreless Foundation. I am in the shade Porcelain because I am extremely white, but I absolutely love this foundation. This foundation, it just like, it's like putting powder on your face and I guess for some people matte like is the equivalent to cake, if you get what I mean. Like some people think matte product equals cake, like a cake face. But for me it works because I tend to have quite oily skin. Like my skin can be dry in some places but majority of the time it is oily. So that's why I decided to give this foundation a go and I absolutely love it. Like if you have oily skin and you necessarily don't want to spend so much money on a high-end foundation, I just got this one because I was just like, I can't be bothered spending all that money on getting a really, you know, high-end foundation. I was like, I'm just going to spend my money on a foundation that I've wanted to try and I've wanted to use and I haven't got around to doing it. And then I just went out and bought this and I'm honestly so happy with the results of this foundation, especially I just think it does keep my face matte the entire day, but not the matte of like it being cakey, if you know what I mean. So if you do have oily skin and you're looking for something to mattify your skin, a foundation in this case, then I would definitely go for this one. And they have this in so many different shades, like so many shades, it's ridiculous. The next product that um, I loved in the month of September, um, if you have seen my makeup tutorials, you will definitely know what this is, but um, I have loved the Too Faced Contour Kit. I don't think I've mentioned this in like one of my previous favourites, but I but because I don't think I have, I just think it needs to be mentioned because I love this so, 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 so much. Like, so much. I always am constantly use this. I use this every single day. I constantly use the medium cocoa shade to contour my face with. And I am constantly using the light cocoa shade to set my concealer when I put it on my face. I sometimes use the dark con light contour shade. I use the dark contour shade when I am more tanned, which obviously it's winter here in Australia. Well, going out of winter now. So I'll be tanning more often, so I'll be using the darker shade. But in the winter, I tended to stick with the medium one and then the highlighting shade I do use but I have other highlighters so I kind of tend to like mix and match my highlighters but it doesn't change the fact that I absolutely love this product it is a holy grail makeup product of mine and once it's all gone I will definitely be going back and purchasing more so yes the next product I have to show you is eyelashes and they are the glam by manicure natural eyelashes Oh, they are number one Taylor and it says two ultra fine lashes with an invisible band for a discreet natural looking finish. I have worn these probably about four times I guess which is really disgusting. I mean like I hope everybody else reuses really eyelashes but I do. But um, yeah I've worn these about like five times now and I just love them. Like. I always get compliments on them, but it's always kind of the compliment whether it's like, are those real or are those fake? I actually wore these yesterday and I did have a compliment and they were, and it was actually a lady in a Lush store and she was like, she was like, are those real or fake eyelashes? Because they are long and I was like, no, they are fake. I wish they were real, but no. But um, yeah, so if you can get your hands on a pair of these, I'd highly recommend because they are natural and they do look natural on you. So yeah. Moving on to skincare, the first product I have to show you that I loved in the month of September is the Nivea Refreshing Toner. Now I love this toner. I um, I tend not to use primer every day, majority of the time just because I forget, but I use this toner every single day. And I know people use the Nivea Men's Aftershave Balm to um, like as primer, some girls use that as primer. Um, but I definitely think using this before putting your makeup on every single day, I noticed that it did tend to 
like my, make my makeup stay on the whole entire day and I just think this is a lot better for your face as this is something that is meant to sit on your face all day if you know what I mean apart opposed from the Nivea Men aftershave balm I looked in the ingredients of this and compared it to the Nivea Men's aftershave balm and they pretty much they have similar like quality similar ingredients used to make the two but this one is definitely more a healthier option for your face and I find that this Putting this on every day has kept my makeup on every day and it's improved my skin at the same time. It stops the um, chemicals and stuff, well not chemicals, oh I guess chemicals, the chemicals and stuff from like some of the foundation and other things that I apply to my face daily for makeup that could be potentially harassing my skin or ruining my skin. This toner just stops it from seeping into my skin and yeah I just love this. I've seen immense amount of improvement within my skin since I have started using this so I love it I loved it in the month of September and I will continue to use it the next skincare product that I have to show you is this I don't actually know how to pronounce it it's ERHA21 and then it is acne care lab an acne cleanser scrub contains salicylic acid and sulfur now sulfur is really good for your skin um, I got this found out about this got this from my older brother's girlfriend she used this for her skin and um, it got to a point where she kept on using it and she saw results like for months on end when she first started using it but it gets to a point where it's like your skin gets used to it and then your skin's like no nah, you need to find something else now so she bought heaps of this and then she stopped using it and then she gave it to me and I started using it and I've seen amazing like results with my skin like my acne since I've started this I get less acne and it comes to me being on my period and stuff like that I definitely do get more pimples because every girl gets more pimples when it comes to that time of the month but um, when I'm not on my period I used to constantly get acne but when I started using this I noticed a huge difference and I get less acne and I just think my skin is so much better and I can honestly say that I feel that it is from this because I haven't changed anything else in my daily routine if you know what I mean apart from putting this into it so it's this I love this if you can get your hands on it then please get your hands on it because it's worked for me and I'm hoping that it's gonna work for you next up moving on for my skincare I have the Garnier Micellar cleansing water all-in-one and I'm sure you've heard many 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 youtubers rave about this and love it and just say how amazing it is and I love it I love it I've never ever ever had an easier job of taking my makeup off with anything else apart from this like this just glides makeup off so easily and I just love it so much and I have the green one and this one is for combination to oily skin as I said before I tend to be more on the oily skin side and I did have the pink one before I tried out this one but I tried out this one as it says it is for oily skin so I use this and I think this one is just so much more better it's so much more fitting for my skin type but um, I did use the pink one as I said before and the pink one worked perfectly fine for me as well but I just feel like this one is better for me so I can say that the pink one is good too but I do love this one if you have oily skin so I'd highly 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 recommend going and getting this I love this so much and my mum I've actually gotten my mum into this now my mum loves to use this instead of the stuff she uses because I don't even know what it is she uses like this milky kind of one to take off her foundation and then she uses like another water type one like this that's meant fit to take off eye makeup but the milky one just does not do any wonders and it makes your skin feel so weird so I've gotten her onto this and now she's using this and she loves it <laughs> so it's good to I can make an impact on my mum to go get something like this but if I can impact on make an impact on you guys and make you guys go try it then go for it because I love it and I hope you love it too. <laughs> 
Moving on to the last thing for my September favourites. My last September favourite is a song and it is called Breathe and it's by Pluto. I actually found this song from That's So Jack in one of his Songs You've Never Heard Of Before videos. I love watching those videos because I love the music he listens to and the music he listens to is kind of like the type of music I listen to and it's like relatable on a level the music he listens to and he finds some good music like this song I'm about to show you I fell in love with and I totally understand like when Jack explained it he was just like the way he sings that part and the way he sings that part I was like I feel you I was like I love it so yeah I think it's only fair we take a listen to it so you can breathe baby so you can breathe baby I just love it. to show for you for everything that I loved in the month of September. I thoroughly hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you got something out of it by watching it. I hope you go test out all the products I like and I hope you love them too. And yes, give this video a big thumbs up if you would like to see more of videos like this and if you would like to see more of me and my face then feel free to subscribe. I upload videos every single week and I will see you next week with another one. Bye!